friends, it's me, Trisha, with Becoming Me. I have another chicken love box. <laughs> if you want to see what's inside, stick around. Friends, you remember last time I told you, well, sorry. Last time I told you that my shirt was too small, I had contacted them, they got right back to me. They sent me the shirt with a thank you card for my patience and for being a good customer and whatnot. And they didn't ask for the other shirt in return. They really have nice customer service. I'm very pleased with them. Let's see what's inside my second chicken love box. I have to go outside and check on them as well. So I will bring you out there and show you. It's not a great day today, <laughs> but I'm all dressed in black. I don't know what problem is. You ever have those days? Okay, but I do have on fancy new jewelry that I'm trying out from Roxbox. I'll put a card up here. I was covering it, I don't know why. So you can see that unboxing when it's up. Okay, what's inside for your flock? This is the March 2021 mini box. Mini, 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 mini box. There's another shirt. <gasps> I love it. Okay, so full disclosure, I don't know my size. If you've watched this channel before, you pretty much know that I'm in between sizes a lot. However, I do know that I'm not a small and that other shirt was wrong. So I asked for a large, cause I didn't know if it was like a men's unisex or what it was. And the large was a little big, but I can shrink it and it's fine. So then I went in again, these people must think I'm crazy and I feel really bad. And I ordered a medium. <sighs> Look at this. <laughs> I love this. I love this. <gasps> so excited. I guess you really have to like raglan sleeve baseball shirts. This is my second one. And I, I love it. I love how the bottom is surged. Nice. You don't really have to surge knit fabric, but it looks, it looks good. It's looking really good. I can't wait to wear this. Oh my goodness. So cute. Okay, I think I was even talking about something. I got dist I distracted myself. This is what I do lately. <laughs> Inside this, there's the exotic nutrition black soldier fly larvae. I've gotten a bigger one of these at Walmart, but they were like really black pieces in there that wigged me out. And normally I'll just put my hand in and scoop it. And I was like, oh, no. My girls would be interested in trying this. Usually what I do now is I have this big Folgers um, plastic tub that I just mix things in and kind of spread it around for them. So I was in the middle of telling you too that I switched, we switched our resident hens in together to live together. And for the most part, it worked out okay. I'm gonna check on them again right now. We put them in the middle of the night, like we were told to do. Some people have that mindset. You put them in the middle of the night. We did that. The next day, they seem to be getting along fine. And then throughout the day, my husband noticed that one of them was really getting bullied to the point of getting plucked and had some, a raw wound. So immediately he took that one out and put it in its own little place. We put the hen healer on it that we got in one of our other boxes and it's isolated for now. We'll figure out what to do next. So I'll bring you out there after this is over. Okay, back to the box, sorry. <laughs> Oh, wait, easy worms. So I guess this is considered one. Okay, I'll go with that. I'll put it all together and see what happens. Nice, I've never heard of this one. It's 100% natural. I don't know if you have. What is this? Look at this. What is this? A Serapi rooster, am I saying that right? Rooster messenger bag. It's so adorable and useful too. Lots of pockets and zippers and a super handy on the go size. Woo! All righty. That was a lot of crinkling. Hey, you know what? I could use this paper again because it's very nice, right? So why do I keep messing with it? Let's put it over here. Okay. Oh, this is too, too, too cute. Don't eat that. All right. 
Rocky thinks it's for him. I'm sorry, buddy. It's not for you. Oh, wow. Let's see. I don't know why I looked confused for a minute. I was trying to figure out what the uh, pull tab said on the zipper. It was distracting. It was very distracting. This is so cute. Look, I can adjust it so that I could wear it as a crossbody. It does have all the pockets that they speak of. Does my phone fit in the front? Oh, it does. Look, it fits my phone with a pop socket and a case in the front. Another little pocket here, which is not little at all. It goes all the way down to the bottom. It's a big pocket. This box keeps getting better and better. <laughs> I'm, I'm not kidding here. <laughs> I'm sorry. I love this. I love it. I really do. Really cute. <laughs> well, like animal print in the middle there and the stripe. <laughs> it's cute. All right. That's been a great box, okay? A couple treats for them. A bag and a fun shirt. I love my mini box this time. I liked my one last time too, but now as I'm getting more used to it, I'm, I don't know what my problem is, but I really, I love it. I can't wait to see what's in the next box. Let's take a trip out to my ladies because I hear them making noise. We already collected four eggs for them, from them. So I want to make sure that everyone is okay and behaving. Okay, so here they are. One of them's missing. She must be in the coop. We're going to try to give them some of these. Even though I said I put them in a container, they know I have something and they want it. Oh, here's my other friend too. I'm gonna check on them, make sure they're okay. And over here, we have our poor little friend that was getting picked on. The back is all a mess. I don't know if you could see her. This is Jan. I, for some reason, I call her him. I don't know why. Hello, baby. So, the friends don't like her. I don't know what's happening. I'm gonna give her some of these treats. Hold on. All right, these seem to be a hit. <laughs> they are plump. <laughs> they are plump ones. All right. Oh, look at my friends. See, the Rhode Island Reds are the, used to be in that red cage, and then my son made us, whoops, I forgot, I'm a beast, I forgot about this new part we put on. Our son made us this nice, beautiful coop for these ladies. We moved them over. And they don't want to share their beautiful coop. Look out, ladies. So I figured I'll come in here with them. And. We'll see how they like these. These two girls here, oh, I used the whole bag. <laughs> These two girls are new to the tribe. They were in that red coop. They're Easter eggers. They give us beautiful blue and green eggs. They're very kind. I'm hoping that they're not getting pecked like their friend was. Meanwhile, these ladies, they run the roost. And I'm hoping that they'll be kind to their new roommates here. I 
well, it appears that they like them. This one wants more. <laughs> hey, there is no more. She loves it. <laughs> well, those were a hit. This other thing that came in one of my other boxes right here, it's going unnoticed, if you could see. I don't think they're really pecking at that at all. I'm not really sure why. I'm not sure. Oh, and their ball that you fill it up with the treats, they just bust it open. They figured out how to bust it open. <laughs> this girl is always very curious. Hi. Hello. I call her Cinnamon. She's so sweet. Look at her. She's a sweet girl. That's Cinnamon. But this one's fresh, right? She's so sweet. I don't know if there's eggs in here, but I see feathers. That doesn't make me happy. Maybe it's from the other chicken. 